Annie Hall proved to be a career-defining role for Diane Keaton, fittingly culminating with her Academy Award for Best Actress. Woody Allen created the character especially for her, even down to using Keaton's real surname, Hall. Keaton was born Diane Hall. She later wrote that she was, quote, elevated to the role of an inarticulate young woman who wanted to mold herself into someone more sophisticated. Inarticulate? Awkward? It was a walk in the park. And Keaton added, you have to remember, I was Annie Hall. The Hollywood Reporter recognized that Keaton's modesty masked enormous talent, stating in its review, if Allen brings his own oddball intellectual humor to the film, Keaton adds the charm and warmth and spontaneity that makes it all plausible. Annie Hall marked Keaton's first Oscar nomination. She's earned three more since, all in the Best Actress category for Reds from 1981, Marvin's Room from 96, and Something's Gotta Give from 2003. Coming up, Jack Lemmon and Shirley MacLaine star in the Best Picture winner from 1960, directed and co-written by Billy Wilder. The Apartment is next on TCM. Next on TCM, The Apartment. Then Gigi, and later, the great Siegfeld. Oscar is center stage tonight. Hi, I'm Dave Carger, 